So we're here and we're celebrating a 10 year anniversary of our relationship with the People's Postcode Lottery. Originally they gave us a £10,000 grant to buy our first diesel van which got us around uh, to Ocean School and to protests and activist points and they've been growing their support for us over the years. Most recently their funding has allowed us to work more with local communities to share our passion for the ocean and then try to persuade and influence policymakers and others that we need to take better care of our water quality in its state. So we want as many people as possible to join us as activists to lobby for a better future for our oceans. So we're here today, we're doing a beach clean, it's going to be good, it's a nice day, hopefully it's not going to rain. So we found a lot of uh, small plastics. I think we found some kind of circuit board. A beautiful plastic ring. Of course barbecue, bits and pieces. It's nice to actually get out and feel as though you're making a difference. And it is quite shocking to see how much odds and ends there are lying about. Woo! Yeah, big round of applause for everyone. So people collecting on the jars, thank you. That's been a fantastic way to visualise exactly what we found. So far we've weighed in at 77.6 kilos, which is absolutely fantastic between us. Not only do we actually collect the waste off the beach, we also audit that data and look specifically at finding the top 12 polluting companies because brands are a really good way to target big corporations, people in power that can make large-scale change. This is being on the beach and doing a clean. What do we take off? 77 kilograms of pollution off the beach today. So that makes you all ocean activists. But I want to thank People's Postcode Lottery as well. Like, your support has really enabled SAS to go on a new trajectory because we are going to change the world. Yay!